Okay, the easiest way to do this question um, is to use multipliers. A real common wrong answer to this is 80%, and I'm going to show you why that's not correct. So I'm going to work out the multipliers first, so an increase of 20% first. So I'm going to start off with 100%, I'm going to add 20%, that gives me 120%. I'm going to work that as a multiplier, so 120 divided by 100 equals 1.2. So if I times something by 1.2, it will increase by 20%. Next, I'm going to do the 60%. So 100% plus the 60% equals 160%. And I'm going to make that a multiplier by dividing it by 100 and I've got 1.6. So if I times something by 1.6, it will increase it by 20 uh, by 60%. So what do I do? So we've got Billy here, and James collects 20% uh, more. So I get Billy's, and I times it by 1.2 to get James's. Then we've got Sam, who collects 60% more. So I get James's, and I times it by 1.6 to get Sam's. So in total, I'm doing times 1.2 times 1.6. So let's just do that as one multiplier. So 1.2 times 1.6. So I get calculator, 1.2 times 1.6. And I get the answer of 1.92. Now 1.92 is the multiplier. But we've kind of got to work backwards to work out what percentage increase it is. So to work backwards, you just do the opposite. You times by 100, so divide by 100, so 192. And instead of adding uh, on 100%, we take away. So 192 take away 100 equals 92%. So it's actually an increase of 92%, not 80%. And it's because when uh, James, uh, sorry, Billy has 20% more than James, so Billy has a bigger amount. And then when 60% uh, of it's calculated to work out what Sam has, that's a bigger amount for Billy. So you won't, you will expect it to be more than 80%. So 92% is a probably correct answer, and through our working out, we've shown it is a correct answer.